What up YouTube, y'all know what it is, y'all know who it is. It's the Ginger, the Ginger 31 to be exact. And this here is my one year ownership, you dig? Actually, I'm a little bit overdue. I got this joint in December of 19, but we'll get into that later. This car, Man, hey, I love this motherfucker, dog. Like, it, it, it gave me one problem, and, 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 and you know, I work in the, the auto industry, so I already know how that goes. But it gave me one problem, warranty fixed that, the boy was out the door. So, oh yeah, you see that back there? That's, that's, that's another mind, man. I, I'm gonna get out the car and show y'all, like, basically, what all I've been doing to the ride. I know you see the louvers in the back. I know you see this right here. You know, we ain't got no trunk space or nothing like that, but I'm gonna get out, show y'all what it is and give y'all a little walkthrough on everything. Let's get to it. For the it. most part, man, this car did nothing but the best for the kid. I caught a lot of bodies in it, caught a lot of Mopar bodies. That's my new wrap. So basically, I got, I got a wrap on here. I got to clean the car. I put these on. Put this, like a satin black car. It is dirty right now. I put louvers on here. Dig. I actually need to put a little bit more 3M tape on. That's kind of coming up a little bit. We'll probably retape that. And that's on both sides of the quarter louvers. So just a little, probably need a little, little refresh or something like that. It ain't nothing. It ain't nothing to a ball. So that was a little walkthrough of the whip or whatever. So basically, I love the car, right? It's pretty, pretty fast. I ain't did no mods yet. Cause y'all know in previous videos, I had that thing going on with the actuator valves and all of that stuff went kind of bad. Had to get that fixed with the warranty. I'm gonna get y'all a drift right quick. Won't press on it too much. Like I say, car gave me no problems for real besides that actuator valve and which is a lot of people in, in the six gens have these problems so it is what it is other than that i mean i enjoy the rear seats in it i put i, I didn't put it in here but i you know i ordered it like that so yeah man if y'all looking for a marrow you know it ain't got too much space as you can see i got my my whole back seat gone you know what i'm saying whatever's in the trunk come through the back seat up into the front seat so you know we ain't got no space we got heated heated stern wheel that came with this down here what else we got you know definitely got a small trunk so if you're looking to you're looking to get you know some ain't too much space so don't go out thinking you're finna go out and have a big old family trip and have all that stuff put in there so that's that on that once i pay this off i'm gonna go ahead and go for the vet or whatever so we'll have more content on that end too but Okay. 
all the way stock, no, no, no splitter. Only thing it really came with is the spoiler. That was it. My spoiler got the camera in it or whatever, so that way I could see like put the camera in my mirror or you know go ahead put the car back up and wait because I my, my daily actually getting the oil change or whatever. So you having to get real close up on it. Yeah, I know women can't drive. Um, it was basically just my one year ownership. I did I did what I had to do in it. I, I, I did me some racing in it. Took it to Mexico. I did. I got me a lot of cosmetic mods to fit me. You know, if you don't, that, that, that's one thing about it, man. When you buy one of these cars, bro, it, it, you cannot leave it how it came off the lot, man. They, it's not your car, bro. Like, even though you might still be paying on the note and all that, that, that's just my take on it. Like, I feel like if let me cut the car. Yeah, I feel like shoot. If you get one of these cars, you cannot leave it stock. Like, you gotta put a wrap on it or something you gotta do something unique to make it your your car like i don't, I don't some hey i don't know like i got my little brother or whatever he he just he got the car he got him his muscle car and everything and just won't do nothing to it just i guess some people just be happy with just doing that but no like i feel like when you get these cars it's just a hidden rule unwritten rule that you mod it up however you want to do it whether you want to you know you want to throw the car in the gym and put some bodons on it or, or really soup it up or get your cosmetic on like what i did you know i'm getting my car looking right how i want it like i'm I, you see what i got cracking up in this motherfucker man so yeah like i i love this shit so with with, with that being said the car came butt naked right i done put louvers on it i done put ss stickers on it oh i done gave my car a wrap Got the splitter coming, depending on how the splitter look. Mess around and have the side skirts come right after that. So it's like, I'm piecing mine together, man. By the summertime, I'm shitting. I'm talking about shitting on shit, you dig? So it is what it is. Uh, I want to appreciate all y'all for tuning in, fucking with me all this time. Like, I done had a YouTube for damn near over 10 years, but I'm finally, like, taking this shit serious. Like, I had a YouTube when Soulja Boy was booming. Like, when Soulja Boy did his thing with the music and all that, I, I had that idea that it, he hit he hit that that light bulb in my dome like bling. I can get on this YouTube shit and, and make something happen or whatever. But I you know I ain't know nothing. So it's it, yeah it is what it is. Like I started late on it. I'm back to it, getting to it. I might not post as much as I need to be posting. But look man, me personally, look I I'm a normal person man. I got I got to work too man. I, I, some of y'all YouTubers man, I, I see man y'all. That's all y'all got to do is just that and. I would like to get to that level. I ain't hating it all. So, but right now, me, I can't dump them videos every day like they be doing. But right now, I appreciate whoever be following and fucking with the kid as of right now. And y'all know I fuck with y'all, right? You know, you know, and I know y'all fuck with me. I appreciate y'all coming to the channel, checking me out. I'm at 727 the last time I checked. We on our way up to that thousand mark, you dig? Everything is everything. What else I wanted to say before I, before I let y'all go, man? I'm going to keep this one brief, like... Like I say, I got another video that's going to be coming up. Yeah, me and the old dude going to put on this front split or whatever, the front lip. And, and I'm just, man, hey, y'all just stay tuned. This motherfucker going to be hard, you dig? <laughs> so, yeah, as I keep fucking rambling and rambling, thank y'all for tuning in. You know, check my Instagram out, the Ginger 31 Really don't fool with Snapchat like that, but that's the Ginger 31 Really don't fool with my Facebook like that, but that's Darion G, you dig? So, appreciate everything. And we out. And you know what? One more thing before I go, man, because I'll be trying to get up out of here before y'all get the slogan down packed. What's my slogan? Don't watch TV, watch me. Gender, gender, gender.